Omar Hillel versus Alberto Espinosa. It'll be very interesting to see how Omar fights tonight, seeing as he has a martial arts background more towards Shotokan karate. Four rounds or less is what we're looking at. Battle on the mainland, Tabriz Promotions, Texas City. This is her son Chow, commentator for you tonight. And here we go. Omar coming and taking the center of the ring. Alberta throwing the big overhand left. Backing Omar up just a bit. Alberto looking for the counter. Omar pushing the pace. But Alberto, dangerous with the overhand left. Landing a couple strong left hooks to Omar, dazing him just a bit, but Omar's back, taking the pace, pushing the pace, taking the center of the ring. Omar lands a strong overhand right. The southpaw, Alberto, countering with some strong body shots and overhand rights. Omar still pushing forward, leading with the jab, having a, having a hard time finding his rhythm. Alberto putting the pressure with some good left uppercuts and overhand rights. Alberto with his back on the ropes, but coming with some strong counters. Omar coming in tight. He's a little bit taller, but has a little slighter reach. Might want to try using a little bit longer range attacks, but Alberto's doing a good job baiting him in, countering with some strong left uppercuts and overhand rights. Omar with the combination, finishing with the uppercut. Right uppercut. Alberto, lead hand, low. Alberto landing some good overhand rights and some lefts to the body. Omar with the combination, straight left to the face, right to the body, quick flurry of hooks, and Alberto's out of the corner. Both fighters about middle of the ring now. Alberto reaching with the straight cross. Once again, Alberto's our southpaw fighter right now. Dangerous overhand rights and good lefts to the body. Alberto with the straight left lands on Omar's chin. Alberto circling out, throwing some good body shots. Alberto looking to land a strong left to Omar's body. Omar hunting, keeping Alberto on the ropes, landing some good strong lefts and rights to the head. Alberto with his back in the corner, countering with some strong combinations in the clinch. Omar's hands dropping for a second, but he looks like he's regained his composure. Alberto still baiting Omar to come in so he can land some strong, some strong counter shots. Omar catching his breath. I think he's taking, oh, Alberto with the hard left uppercut in each other's face. Very big, very good round, very strong round. Looks like it's gonna be a match between Omar coming in, leading with the combinations, and Alberto throwing strong counter combinations. Both guys are throwing bombs tonight. It could go either way. I think it's gonna come down to who lands first, folks. Omar has some slight swelling over his left eye. Alberto not even sitting down. Alberto's hyped right now. Not even sitting down, not even taking a break. Here comes second round, folks. Fireworks going off in this fight right now. Looks like Alberto's starting to put the pressure now. Pushing forward, Omar backing up. Big overhand left by Alberto. Alberto loading up the left uppercut. Omar hasn't thrown too much just yet in this round. Still trying to find his range, trying to find his way, safe way in. 
Alberto circling out, taking the center of the ring again. I think, I think Omar might be having some slight issues, breathing out of his nose. Not too many punches thrown right now. Alberto missing with some wide swinging. Omar doing a good job protecting himself. Countering with some left hooks. Alberto circling. Hard left to the body by Alberto. Circling out with the right to the head. Alberto initiating a lot of the, uh, the exchanges. Omar not, not starting the combos too soon. Alberto with the left and the right. Omar asking for more, talking to Alberto. Alber Omar coming in with the flurry of strikes. Alberto on, back on the ropes. The ref is separating the fighters. Omar throwing strong rights. They're getting close with the clinch. And they're up again. Alberto with his back on the ropes. Quick exchange. Alberto seemed to be frustrated with the way Omar was striking out of the, out of the separation. Alberto still waiting, still waiting to counter, keeping his lead hand low. Throwing big left hook and right hook off, the, off, the ja off Omar's jab. Good body shots by Alberto. Alberto keeping that lead hand low, trying to bring Omar in so he can land some strong shots. Omar coming in, but not really throwing too much on the step in. I think he's looking to try to get Alberto on the ropes again so he can throw with confidence. Good, le uh, good lead straights, good lead jabs by Omar. Lead, good lefts to the body. Alberto asking for more unfazed. And here we go, folks. 10 seconds less, 10 of the second round. Alberto pushing Omar with his back on the ropes. Omar working the body and uppercuts. And that's it, folks. Going into a third. I would say Albert was. Uh, I would say Albert was more active that round. Omar was coming forward, but not throwing a whole lot. Every once in a while, he'd get Alberto on the ropes and throw good flurry combinations. But Alberto has some dangerous counterattacks, folks. Hooks to the body, uppercuts right up the middle. Albert being the southpaw has some strong, dangerous lefts. Especially with the shorter stature, he's able to bring him in hard to the body. Alberto, excuse me, Alberto. Espinosa. Quick shout out to our sponsors, St. Michael's Emergency Rooms, Broadway Buffalo Wings, Dines Distributing Company. Here comes round number three, folks. Herson Chow commentating for you tonight, that is me. The crowd chanting Omar's name, looking for some Looking for some combinations here, looking for some points to get landed. Alberto with the overhand left. First strike of this round. Alberto with a wide uppercut. Omar's corner asking for activity, asking for action. Alberto backing himself up in the corner, coming back into the center. Hard right to the body by Alberto. Omar countering with a straight right, but Alberto coming right back with another two or three punch combination. Omar on the attack now. Alberto on the ropes. Alberto asking for Omar to throw more. Alberto with the counter. Alberto with his back on the ropes. Omar not able to maintain pressure. He's backing up to the center of the ring. Alberto with the, with the, with the attack now. Push him forward. Omar's not throwing enough strikes, I think. He's throwing one or two punches, and Alberto's able to counter with two or three. Having a, having a little bit of trouble keeping up with the, 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 the numbers right now. Alberto's throwing some hard body shots, hard punches. 
any one or two quick strikes Omar's throwing. Alberto's coming back with some hard lefts and rights, looping hooks to the body. Omar lands a good right hook to Alberto's head. Alberto asking for more though. Omar seems to be landing some good jabs, but Alberto's coming back with some hard hooks. Body, head, head, body. Putting a, putting a lot of counter pressure on Omar. Alberto keeping his lead hand low though, trying to bait Omar to come in. Alberto throwing some jabs out. Omar with a good head movement. Nothing too solid landing. Alberto throwing the straight left, circling out. Alberto with his back nearly on the ropes, circling back into the center of the ring. Omar with a wide right. Not too much is landing clean right now. Both fighters circling, trying to find, their, trying to find a good combination, good rhythm. Alberto with the lunge and left. Circle out with the right to the body. 10 seconds. Who's gonna push it right now? Who's gonna push it right now? Both leaning on each other. I think they're feeling a little bit, a little bit windy right now. And that's it, folks, for the third round. Texas City, we're going to our fourth and final round. Do you like Alberto in the red corner or Omar Hilaire in the blue corner? Here we go. After those three rounds, who do you have so far? Oh, definitely you have Omar. Omar, the Gaza kid, is looking good. The other yeah. thing I noticed is they don't like each other. Right, I can they, tell. From the first round at the end of it, it looks like referee Gary Simons literally had to split them up. I felt bad for him. Well, they keep talking to each other in between rounds, taunting each other, so. Yeah, they're not love stories either. Right. They're not singing a country right, song. Right. Now, I see Omar pushing forward a lot, but Alberto seems to be throwing a lot of strong counter strikes and in the higher numbers. And it looks like he wants to fight. Uh, Alberto wants to fight as a phone. He wants to fight like in a phone booth. He yeah, wants to absolutely. stay close and yeah, nice absolutely. in that pocket. Gaza Kid's right, giving him a lot right. of space, and he wants to keep it that right. way. I think Alberto understands he doesn't have as much range as Omar, but uh, Omar's not throwing, I don't think, in my opinion, enough numbers at one time. You know, he's coming in close and giving Alberto exactly what he wants. He's going in and out, and that's it. He's not right, staying right. in there to give him a good 10. Right. Uh, that comes from conditioning, typically, with a lot of these guys, and it comes from strength and right. the will to fight. The Gaza Kid has that will to fight, and I think he's right. going to pull this game no, off. No, this absolutely, fight off. absolutely, absolutely. Absolutely. The other good o thing Omar, that yeah, Omar's looking hungry. Omar's looking hungry for the win. Yeah, he's like a wolf right now, and his footwork, his footwork stays in there. He gets off balance a little bit, but for the most part, right now he has up against the ropes. He doesn't want to clinch. Right. Gary Simons unclinched it, but he wants to stay in there. Omar's keeping the pressure on him. Lots of hooks, left and right. Alberto getting his back off the ropes now. It's going back to the center of the ring. Alberto with the strong right to the body. The Gaza kid, what would really help Omar is if he worked on a lot of body shots, got more strength in his, uh, in his back. Right. He would be a lot more vicious. He has good range, good length, especially for his size. He's fighting at a 152 Absolutely. rank, so. Mm -hmm. Right. He just got hit hard. Alberto with a good left to the now he's going to, to the, the body jaw to... and to the body. Uh, Omar asking for more. Good left by Omar over the top. You know, Chad, we're scheduled for four, but I think these guys could go six or eight. Absolutely, they still got a lot of energy. A lot of gas left in the tank. Coming that sweep right. and left. Good body shots by Alberto. You're gonna get a nice applause from this crowd here. Absolutely, down absolutely. Down in Texas City. He looks a little tired though, he's dropping his arms. That's not a good right. sign. I think Alberto's trying to bait Omar to come into his range. That's and that way he can yeah. fight in that phone booth like absolutely, he wants. Absolutely, absolutely. With those body shots and uppercuts. Right there, that left to the body. He's trying to work out Omar's liver right now. He needs to drink a lot of water tonight. Yeah. <laughs> so you can see that tight shot. Yeah. See, he's sweeping around. Yeah. Alberto needs to work on that jab, keep it tight. Right there. Right he there, got Alberto, hard body shots. He's getting clocked. Yeah. Omar coming right back though. He stays in there, here we go. Last 10 seconds of the round of the fight. Here we go. It's melee central. Absolutely, absolutely. Oh. Alberto winning this exchange. 
I will give that last exchange to Alberto. I think we want to see a yeah. rematch. Absolutely. Thank you so much for letting me join you. Yes, sir. Thanks for joining us. I don't know, folks. That was a hell of a fight. Alberto raising his hands in confidence. Alberto coming to pay some respects in the blue corner. What a fight, folks. If you're not here, you're missing out. Battle on the mainland, Savarese Promotions down here in Texas City. Great fight, one of my favorites so far tonight. Heavy exchanges, Alberto coming in with heavy body shots and uppercuts, and Omar coming right back. All right, here we go. Jabs and straight rights. Putting a lot of pressure on Alberto on the ropes. I would say Omar now. had some pretty high numbers, but Alberto had a lot of power shots to the body. A lot of talk this fight during Four rounds. the ring. Four rounds. Me and Gerzon Chow sitting here right now. Sitting here with the champion, Gerzon. What's up, Stephen Lawhorn? What's up, sir? Good to see you again. Good to see you too, we sir. got Gerzon. It's going to the judges' scorecards. How do you have it? I have Gerzon. I think it's going to be close. I think Alberto has it, though. He had a lot more power shots well, I'm landed. I'm going to go with Omar. Yep. I'm telling you, I mean, wow. there, there, were, there were a lot of numbers in there. You know, uh, Omar was pushing the pace. He was taking the center of the ring a lot, but he would throw one, two punch combinations, and Alberto would come back every time. Two, three, four punch combinations, hard yeah. to the body. Yeah, both these guys put in a lot of work. It's, it's a hard one to call. Yeah. And we're going to take a break, guys, going on to the next fight. We'll see you on just a sec.